New lines of the COVID Omicron variant, like BA.4 and BA.5, help to trigger a wave of reinfections because people who have already captured the COVID-19 contract again. Now, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention American follow a new, concerned variant, BA.4.6. This week, the CDC included the BA.4 spin-off in its weekly follow-up of cases, the data director of the tweeting agency that the new subvariant had in fact circulating for several weeks in the states, united. The CDC designates strains as variants of concerning if they have greater transmissibility, reduced effectiveness of treatment, increased severity or neutralization reduced by antibodies. According to the CDC, BA. 4.6 represented 4.1% of cases wearing for the week ending on July 30th. The new variant is more widespread in the region including Iowa, Kansas, Missouri and Nebraska, where it represents 10.7% of local cases. The region of the Atlantic's environment and the South also see the rates of BA. 4.6 above the national average. The new strain has also been detected in 43 other countries, according to Outbreak, a community COVID information standard. BA.5, that an epidemiologist called the worst version of the virus we have seen because of its transmissibility and its ability to escape existing immunity is still dominant in the United States, representing 85.5% of all cases wet in July 30th. BA.4 and BA.5 are responsible for driving a global increase in hair cases, including in places that had retained the virus to the current wave, such as the Chinese city of Macau. Currently, there is not many data as to whether BA.4.6 is better than BA.4 or BA.5 to escape immunity. Dr. Eric Topal, founder and director of the Research Translational Institute Scripps, tweeted Tuesday that the BA. 4.6 mutation does not seem to be worrying compared to BA.4 or 5, with only a handful of new mutations by relation to previous subvariants. Omicron specific vaccines. Even if BA.4.6 is not considerably worse than existing strains, the speed at which new variants of emerging concern are alarming public health officials who provide for new vaccine boosters this fall. Friday, the Food and Drug Administration of the United States said that it would seek to approve boosters who directly target the BA.5 variant this fall, rather than making more Americans eligible for a second booster based on the strain of COVID-2020. Currently, only Americans over 50 are eligible for a second booster. But the new variant, 